Hey guys, get ready with me. Okay, so I had my mom call me out of school early because I swear I've literally had the worst day of my entire life. So thank you, mother. I think I'm just like really overwhelmed by life right now and too much is going on at one time. Basically what I need is for life to hit pause for five seconds. Anyways, lately I've just caught myself crying randomly over stuff. I don't even know why. And like, I'm literally not a crier. I don't really cry very often. And I'm not saying that to like act different or anything. It's just, that's like not who I am. But life has not been lifing. So I'm gonna take myself to Hobby Lobby and go buy a Christmas tree. I feel like that's the only exceptional solution in this case. I'm actually not excited for tomorrow because we have PSATs and I don't wanna deal with all that. This week has literally just been test, test, and more tests, and it's so annoying. Like, please just give me a freaking break. Anyways, for some reason, I'm on the verge of tears right now. I literally don't know why, but like, I'm trying to hold them down because it's freaking annoying, and I'm trying to do my makeup. All right, bro, what the heck? I was literally just trying to curl my lashes. I literally just struggled so hard to put on my mascara without crying, and like, I almost ruined it 10 times. Anyways, I feel like I just feel like this because I just, I don't know, I feel so alone right now. And it's not like physically alone. I don't know how to explain it. Like, yeah, I have a great group of friends and a loving family, but I don't know. The only reason I'm posting this kind of get ready with me, because usually I would never post something like this, is because like I want people to know they're not alone and being sad. Like right now, I feel extremely alone and stuff, and I just want other people to feel like they're not I'm literally about to go drive and get in my car and listen to Gracie and Lana. Literally my whole makeup is gonna be off by then. All right guys, bye. Thanks for watching today's Get Ready With Me. Get ready with me for school. I was gonna say, I don't wanna go to school, but bitch I said that in all my fucking videos, which I think is pretty clear. I don't wanna go, but here we are. I feel like my get ready with me in the morning are so fucking boring because like, I'm literally like half asleep. Pero les cuento that yesterday I was about to get in a fucking fight. Well, not really like in a fight, but there was this bitch that was just not wanting to cooperate with life right now. Like that bitch thought that I would, I wasn't gonna say nothing. And that bitch fucking watching my get ready with me. Cause the other day I fucking walked in the class. I've been having beef with her cause I don't think she liked me. I don't like her. The other day, she I walked in the class and she was like, "Get ready with me for school." And I was like, "Bitch, I'm gonna do a fucking get ready with me to punch her ass." But yeah, people just get on my fucking nerves so much. Like, why can't you just fucking be normal? Like, I don't do shit to you. And if she's watching this bitch, fuck off. Because I don't like you. I have, like, mixed feelings about getting ready for school. Because I like it, but then at the same time, I don't. But then I do. Because it's just so common with their period. But then I don't like waking up early. Okay, I'm done doing my hair. After almost crashing out, but it's okay. I'm gonna go wash my face and brush my teeth really quick. Okay, I'm back and I have like 20 minutes to do my makeup, so let's hurry the fuck up. I really need to go makeup shopping because, like, I have nothing more left. Like, my makeup is gone, long gone. And my fucking skincare porque ya no tengo nada. So, yeah. I'm so fucking excited for winter. Like, I don't think you guys understand how cute my fits are gonna be. La neta, no me acuerdo nada. I set before and then after my makeup. Cause I have to have my makeup locked in. I like Bob the Painter when I do this. Cause oh, what was it, Bob Ross? Like change now, so go watch my kid dress. With me. Get ready with me saying Halloween costumes I better and do not want to see this year. I swear on everything I love, I better not see anyone dressing up as a nun. I don't think I have to explain. I'm not Catholic, but that's so disrespectful. I better not see anyone wearing those stupid nurse or little police jumpsuits. Also, if this is on your For You page, don't forget to comment For You page in the comments. As always, I'm noticing and following everyone back who comments For You page. I'm not talking about like the kid version, like nurses or whatever, but I'm pretty sure y'all know what version I'm talking about. It's like literally, why are you doing that? I also better not see anyone purchasing any costumes from Dollskill. If you don't know what happened, just literally go look it up and that'll explain it. I also don't even celebrate Halloween, so I don't even know why I'm making this video, but...
Y'all are going to hate on me for this, but if you know, you know, I better not see anyone dressed up as an angel on Halloween. Not that it's a bad outfit, but once again, for context, look it up because it's disrespectful. But I'm literally excited because homecoming is literally this Saturday, so let me know if y'all want to vlog. Anyway, I'm not in the mood to wear a lot of makeup, so we're just going to end it off here. But if you stayed all the way to the end, comment down below a purple heart. Let me know if y'all disagree or agree, but your opinion doesn't really matter. Remember to have a great day and remember that God loves you all. This is all out. <laughs> Bye, y'all. Get ready with me for school. Fucking all but. Elf Halo Glove. Bronzy drops. Um, love it. Um, we're, we're not gonna do the Coach's Ivy Glow today, but today we have school. And is we fucking all what? I got a whole nother hole in this but I'm trying to turn the bitch up again. She thick like oozing in a pot. I love that song. I like it a lot, actually. Now we're gonna do this concealer. It's so out. Like, not out, but like it's running out. And I don't wanna buy a new one. Holy shit. It's literally. I miss it too, Slippery. I'm with the fucking drugs. Mm -hmm. I'm going to set just my under eyes with the Charlotte Topper setting powder. And then I'm going to do bronzer. I'm going to use the Makeup by Mario bronzer. Makeup by Mario shade Dark Deep is the bronzer. This is the placement. And after bronzer, we're going to do blush. And then we're going to do my nose contour. I do not know why. I just did my neck. Holy shit. <laughs> Bronzer's done. Now for blush. I'm searching. Found it. Makeup on my not rare beauty blush shading courage. It's so yummy. It's so yummy and so good. Because if you don't, I take it slow. And I'm finger blending it. Okay, that's the now I'm gonna do nose contour. I use the same bronzer and this is gonna be the contouring placement. I can decide. Okay, now highlighter. We're gonna ooh, we're gonna use the benefit cookie highlighter. Lip liner is the NYX nip liner, lip liner in shade nude pink. Now I'm gonna do mascara on the bottom. I use this one. Yeah. Oh, anyway, that's done. I put some James Charles palette, like black on my waterline to make my eyes pop. But last step is setting spray, so let's do that. Okay, that's my makeup done. Bye. Oh, fuck it. Guess we both ain't shit. Guess who's going out today? And you're coming with me. Today we want to look plump. We want to look hydrated. We want to look sun-kissed. I'm going in with my favorite moisturizer. It's the Innisfree Orchid one. This will be a great base so my skin doesn't die. But I literally shaved half of my eyebrow off yesterday. Like, do you see that? There's like this tiny little sliver left. And I need to fill that in because it... Looks horrible. I'm using the NYX brow glue. I seriously haven't found like a better brow gel than like the drugstore ones. So if you have some good ones, please let me know. But I'm just gonna put a tiny bit of foundation on just to cover up my acne scars a little bit. Also, when was the last time you guys washed your makeup brushes? Because I use this one for foundation and blush and it looks nasty and I don't remember the last time I washed it. Okay, the key to your makeup, like not like pilling, piling, pit, like, like peeling off, 
Oh my god, I cannot speak. The key to your makeup like not peeling off is to just not use too many skincare products. I lay all of my cream products first and then I go over the top with powder. I know that seems like common sense to some of you guys, but like I didn't know that. I love blending my concealer with my fingers into my nose bridge so then it just looks like snatched. I have three powder bronzers and I don't know which one to pick. I'm just gonna do the same one that I've been using since seventh grade. This is the Anastasia powder bronzer in the shade Rosewood. I think it would complement so well with this makeup. Here's some real shit real quick. I low-key hate my feet. That sounds like really out of pocket, but like I have big feet. Like I am a size nine and a half in women's, I think. Sometimes I'd be putting on shoes and I just feel like they're like a subway foot long. It's really not that bad until I like put on my dad's Birkenstocks the other day and like they literally almost fit me. Like there's no reason why my little body should be able to fit in my grown dad's Birkenstocks. Should I invest in a foot reduction? <laughs> On top of my liquid highlighter, I'm just going on with some loose highlighter to blind everyone. Post headband hair should be banned. Okay, my hair is actually being stupid today. I'm probably gonna recurl it, but I'm gonna douse myself in the shimmer oil because I think it's like the cutest thing ever. Cut the cameras. That's it for the get ready with me, but I will see you guys tomorrow. Get ready with me while I talk about things that literally need to be addressed. People who say they're getting cyberbullied, like there's a block button and a delete button for a reason. I do know that cyberbullying is real though because trust when I go on Roblox. But if this gets on your For You page, make sure you comment FYP so I can notice all of you guys. Those moms who post their kids in like the weirdest way on social media just for views. Like I'm sure we all know that one mom on TikTok. That girl Molly Noblet or whatever her name is, the girl that was responsible for like the you know of Aubrey like she made that girl herself and she posts like she's an influencer and she has like literal fans like let's not forget what she did like if I was ever responsible for making someone do that to themselves I would not try to have a platform on social media like first off I would be so embarrassed and if I did have a platform it would be about the person that I may do that to themselves People who cheat on their boyfriend slash girlfriend, like, no one's forcing you to be in this relationship. Those girls who literally make fun of, like, the special ed people at the school, like, come on, that's what we're doing now. That's it, but if you made it all the way to the end, comment any color heart. Get rid of me rules my strict parents had on me. First things first is I got my own bed to sleep in when I was 10. So yeah, I slept with my mom until then. And I literally still sleep with my mom sometimes. Next is that I'm not allowed to go anywhere with friends unless she's there. Next is that I'm not allowed to have a phone until I'm 13 and I still don't have one. I can wear a two-piece to the pool, but I'm not allowed to wear a bikini to the pool. And I'm not allowed to wear crop tops or like tight dresses out, but strict parents create sneaky kids. I'm not allowed to wear nails that are like this long. Like they have to be really short, like as short as my fingernails. And I'm not allowed to wear this much makeup out, by the way, guys. So apparently I'm just practicing. Oh, and I'm not allowed to get nose piercing until I'm like 15. And like a belly button one until I'm like 17. And I'm not allowed to post my face on social media, but obviously I don't do that. Bye guys. Hi guys, get ready with me for school. Mm -mm. I'm in a rush today because I decided to skip my first two alarms. It's just one of those days my brain is not braiding this morning. Is it ever actually? But today I was just like having those thoughts. What if I skipped? What would happen? I would fail. I was really contemplating not going, but now that I'm up and getting ready, I'm proud of myself. I've been sleeping in this hoodie and I'm just gonna wear it out today because I can't put together an outfit right now. Honestly, this is kind of the move. I think I'm gonna start sleeping in when I'm gonna wear to school. My ankle is about to be really hydrated because I spilled that all over me. I wish I could tell you I put some effort into my hair this morning, but no, I woke up about 10 minutes ago, peed, and then washed my face. And the bun I slept in, I brushed it back and then put some mousse in it to make it look like a slick back. It's not that bad. I feel like I faked it really good. Fake it till you make it. It's so disgusting and gloomy outside, but I need to get in the habit of wearing sunscreen, so I'm just gonna put this on today either way. Do I even want to put on makeup today? I have like six minutes. Just a little something, perhaps. 
apps if you have early morning class or just need to get up for work or whatever get this eye brightener it's so good by rare beauty it makes it look like i went to bed at an appropriate hour last 8 a.m of the week though like let's get hype because i only have two classes tomorrow and then one on friday and the week's over that made me look so greasy was not planning on putting on powder today but we gotta i think i'm gonna be good today and wear my glasses because i really need to i've been getting migraines from not wearing them oh no i have one minute okay this is the look today whether we like it or not because i don't have time i love you guys bye hey guys get ready with me for school again so today's thursday obviously i already primed the moisturizer by the way okay but anyway today's thursday i have two finals today for my hair cutting class and i'm low-key high-key low-key scared but i know i got it and it's two it's a written one and um the actual like actual haircut the thing i'm low-key scared for the haircut because it's a 90 degree haircut and if you know what that looks like then you know it's hard well it's hard for me i don't know but guys i actually haven't gone out in a minute i feel like there was a party last weekend that one of my friends like was one of the hosts or whatever but i didn't go and then there's another one next weekend i know i said my party era is over but it's like a halloween party so but i don't know i'm probably not gonna go to it either but we shall see because i always say no and then somehow i end up there but i'm probably not gonna go i low-key want to take my lashes off but at the same time like no because i know they're still kind of good but i low-key like they're kind of ugly guys i'm filming a new makeup tutorial tomorrow for my youtube so it should be up hopefully on Saturday because I'm going to try to edit it already like super quick because like, girl, I've been slacking way too much. But yeah, so if you don't subscribe to my YouTube channel, go subscribe to my YouTube channel. Um, this is so ugly, girl. Um, but if you don't subscribe to my YouTube channel, go subscribe to my YouTube channel. Link in my bio. Thank you very much. But hopefully, hopefully it's out by Saturday. Guys, I'm going to get rid of me every day this week that I don't even know what to talk about anymore. Like, yeah, literally. Please don't miss her. Guys, I literally miss my friend. Like, I haven't seen her in forever. Literally, like, she hates me and doesn't ever want to hang out with me. So, I need new friends, please. Um, I don't know what's happening here, but this is not giving cute. What the heck? Okay. Okay, for my lips, my sister just got two new lip liners. Let me turn this down, girl. My sister just got two new lip liners yesterday, so let's use one of them because I just found this my old one in her makeup line. Why do you have it? But just because she has mine, now we can use one of hers. Okay, I put both on. I put the brown one on this side and then the pink one on that side to see which one I like. They're both cute, but I think... Girl, it looks like literally a lip combo. No, it doesn't, girl. What? I don't know which one to pick. I think I'm gonna go with the brown one. Yeah, it's giving more fall. Okay, I ended up changing my lip liner, but I'm almost done with my makeup. It's 7.38, so I'm good on time. But let me put... I need to also change still. I hate that I have to wear black scrubs every day. Like, that is so boring. Like, what if I'm going to wear a cute outfit? Like, hey. Okay, guys, this is the finished makeup. Thank you guys so much for getting ready with me. Bye. Thanks. Oh, my goodness. Good morning. Bad morning. I literally haven't done my, like... I have such a bad cold right now, and I did it yesterday. This came overnight, but I can't breathe, and my eyes are puffy. Okay, let's get ready. But I haven't done, like, a full face of, like, makeup or skincare in a while, so I think we're going to today just because, even though I'm literally wearing a hoodie. I feel like because of volleyball, I haven't been cute. Like, I'm blaming it on that because I have to wear, like, my jersey. Okay, my hair is, like... I don't even want to talk about it. We'll deal with it later. Like, why is it dented there? That it wasn't even in a ponytail. I'm going to crash it out. But because we have to wear our jerseys and warm-ups to school, like, twice a week. And I know, like, everyone obviously knows, like, it's because we're on a sport team. But, like, it ruins my, like, my, my jet. Because then after a game day, I want to just wear hoodies and sweats. But the problem is, is that after a game day, it's either Tuesday Wait, okay, I'm going to explain my logic. Wait, normally our games are on Tuesdays and Thursdays, right? Mondays, nobody wants to dress up. If you want to dress up on a Monday, you go do that, girl. Okay, Tuesdays, we have to wear warm or jerseys. Then, Wednesdays after the game, I want to wear a hoodie and sweats because I'm just tired and I want to, like, be comfy. And then, 
Boom, right back at it. Thursday, we have to wear our warm jerseys. And then right after that, it's a Friday. Like, I want to dress comfortable. So basically, like, at the end of the day, until, like, school season ends, I'm going to be a bum all day. Every day. All week. Every month. But even with school ends, I'm probably still going to be the same, but I'll probably dress up a little bit more or, like, actually, like, get ready. Because hopefully then I'll be, like, less tired. I'm actually, like, annoyed by my hair right now. I don't know what just fell. We're just going to ignore it. But I'm actually, like, ignored by I am a little annoyed by my hair right now. Because why is it fat? It's actually really freaking skinny. What is happening right now with my hair? Like, I can't. Okay, maybe I'll wear it down. We'll see. We'll see. My skin looks so dull. Like, I don't know what's happening with my skin. Because it does not look good. Like, at all. Josie's leaving to get me in 10 minutes, so I'm going to hurry up a little bit just because I want to have extra time. I'm going to whip this bad boy out. Guys, everyone take a look. Say, ooh, ah, thank you. Because look at this pink serum. It's so cute. And it actually makes your skin look so good. I'm pretty sure it's the brightening. Oh, it's soothing and barrier support. But like, I swear, it makes my skin look so much more like bright. Okay, so where is that today? Oh, wait, actually, no, my skin does look brighter. But I just look so bad. Okay, if I keep saying that, I'm going to continue to look bad. So we're just going to not say anything. Zip it, lock it, put it in your pocket. Okay, lock everything in with our moisturizer. It's already been three minutes, and I'm literally just now finishing my skincare routine. I need to, like, I don't even know what I talk about on these videos, but I talk too much. <laughs> talk to a lol. I'm, like, crashing out because I look absolutely insane, and if makeup doesn't save this, then I don't want to go to school. Actually, either way, I don't want to go to school. Guys, homecoming is in approximately 12 days, and that is insane because my dress is not even here. Like, that is actually insane. I forgot to put on my cream blush. It's fine. We're just doing powder today. I think it's coming this Thursday, hopefully. But, like, I'm really scared. Like, I don't want to put it out in the universe. But, like, what if it doesn't look good or doesn't work? Then I'm going to die. I'll just go, like, to freaking somewhere. I don't know. And I will buy, like, a $2 dress and I'll wear it. Boom. Because, <laughs> girl, this dress better look good. Because, guys, it's Lucy in the sky. And I've been hearing so much bad stuff, but then so much good stuff. Like pick a side is it good or bad i know it takes a lot of ship i know the dresses are short apparently which i'm already scared about but like are they good quality are they cute that is my question okay i need to hurry up because josie's leaving in like seven minutes and i just want to have time which i said already but it's obviously not clicking in my brain i need to hurry up okay my favorite part of highlighter is my cupid's bow i absolutely love putting highlighter on my cupid's bow i just like I, I love it so much okay we need to do my eyebrows holy cow and i need to blend in my highlighter bruh okay hopefully i can look cute today because what does that mean sorry i just said another instead of another but my speech impediment is literally coming back a little lower i literally cannot pronounce my freaking t's to save the the life of me well i couldn't and now i can but like i still sometimes say like fair like over no i say there now i say there now because now i think i've trained myself because i was about to say over there but like i'm trying to think of when i say another i just said another another i don't i don't I didn't even realize I had it until someone made fun of me in, like, sixth grade for it. And then I realized that I had it. And I've been, like, working to fix it. Like, I have been working. And it is paying off a bit. Like, I, I can, I'm slowly starting to be able to pronounce my DHs. And that's very good. Josie just called me. Sorry about that. Okay, hopefully my mascara and lips look good. But I don't want to talk about that. I don't want to talk about this eyebrow because it's, like, making me crash out this one's like okay but that's also because i'm blaming it because i haven't like shaven them or done anything to them because i'm waiting till whole cook and i'm getting them waxed and i want them to look really good and i find they look better if the before result was more insane but you still it's not that bad but like it could it it's it's getting there okay lips better come in clutch because my hair isn't normally it's my hair but it's not today like Okay, I do not like how I look. Like, I just feel weird. I think I might change, but I don't think I have time because Josie just left, like, three minutes ago. Okay, I changed my hoodie. I don't want to talk about my hair out. I'm just going to leave it. <sighs> Bye, guys. Peace out. Get ready me for school. I'm so happy it's finally Friday.
But if I'm being honest, like this week went by really quickly. And tomorrow I think I'm going to Fright Fest, so I'm really excited for this. And tomorrow's tomorrow I also have a game, which obviously which obviously I'm excited for. It's 6.52. Usually I don't finish my hair for another like 10-ish minutes. But I don't know. I guess I just finished early today. And I would say that my hair is not fully dry. I just got lazy and stopped the teasing. Because I will not believe you if you say that you enjoy diffusing. Like honestly. Like that honestly just like can't be enjoyable. Like it just cannot be. Like there are days where I like to do my hair and stuff, but majority of the time I don't like it at all. Like I don't like doing it. I don't like sitting for an hour and a half, like brushing and diffusing my hair. And if you're gonna ask me how I sit for an hour and thirty minutes just doing my hair, honestly I have no idea what how and why. So don't even ask me. Anyways, back to Fright Fest. I'm really excited. Um last year I went like three or four times and it was so much fun. And I want to do the same this year, and maybe even more times. It's just, like, so much fun. Oh, I forgot to put my earrings on. I'm going to wear these, like, big-ish hoops. The reason I took them out is because I take them out for volleyball practice, because they're pretty big. Also, you guys, please let me know what videos you want to see, because I feel like I make the same videos, like, every week. So, I don't know if you guys have any, like, videos you want me to post. Because I'm open to all you guys' ideas and into posting, like, other stuff. Because I know I post, like, the same thing all the time. Which I guess is kind of the point of, like, my account. Because it's a Get Ready Me account. But, like, it's fine. Also, guys, I've got a couple questions asking, like, how I deal with, like, people being annoying and, like, about my account. To be honest, I can't really remember a time where somebody was, like, annoying or mean or anything like that about my account. Like, most everyone's anything... At, well, anything's ever said, anyone's ever said to me is just like, oh, hey, like, I follow you, or, like, I've seen you on TikTok. And, like, people that I know. Maybe it's just because I live in, like, a place where people don't really care, or maybe, I don't know. But I used to, like, block everybody. Like, literally, I blocked everybody I knew. And I was so deathly scared that somebody would find out. Honestly, don't ask me why, I just was. But now I don't really care who knows. Like, at all. I don't know, I'm just not really embarrassed by it anymore. Oh my god, this is really hairspray. Anyways, I don't think I have any tests today, but like, I think I might have one. But like, I don't know, my teacher might have like postponed it or something. I don't really know. Also guys, I don't really know what you mean by like... A makeup tutorial because I think I show all my products while I'm doing my makeup and like I show I'm doing it so I don't really know how to make like an in-depth one but um I'll try soon so I'm gonna get my lashes on right back okay guys I just finished up my makeup so I'm ready to go to school I don't have to leave for another hour though so okay that's it bye guys